Y'all didn't believe in us when we was down So don't come round when we up Didn't give it up, was down on luck We focused up until we came up Now we got blessings The spirit of Detroit You too like, comment, subscribe for more thought-provoking content like this. Click the bell icon button. So, Jeff Okuda. Jeff Okuda is someone I'm interested in. I am rooting for this season. Yes, the narrative is flipped. Avery Giovanni is rooting for Jeff Okuda. Because if he wins, we win. As you know, September 12th, September 13th, Jeff Okuda suffered that season-ending injury, the, the ruptured Achilles obviously when we talk about ruptured achilles versus tearing a tour achilles ruptured achilles is the worst gray injury and people actually have to come back from that you know relatively they have to take a relatively long time with that clarification we got him here we got him working out he's been very active on twitter as you know uh if you don't know if you don't follow him on twitter about two weeks ago he posted you know some workouts i'm gonna have them up here and he didn't look fluid. It's kind of a red background. I'm gonna put it in the video. But these, these clear outside workouts, this, this looks fluid. He looks a little more fluid. He looks a little more ready. His technique is good. He looks a little more calm. Now, yeah, he's in shorts and everything, but he's moving very fluidly. And I want y'all to take a look at the comparison, how he was moving two weeks ago. He was moving like a robot, <laughs> you know? And I'm, I'm all for it, man. You know, at the end of the day, this is about hustle. This is about drive. And you, you can't feel sorry for yourself. He's He's got good coaching. Aaron Glenn, Aubrey Pleasant, the Detroit Lions staff, the new health staff, the new training staff with Jill Costanza. He's got a good support system to come back and do well. Uh, my only worry is that he need, he's going to need more time. And that's okay. It's okay for guys to come back fully healthy, Detroit. I know y'all like to rush people back like they dogs and stuff, like whip, whip, whip. But at the end of the day, I would rather right now nurse Jerry Jacobs and Jeff Okuda and draft a corner to take their place immediately until they fully ready in September, fully ready to go. You know, so, you know, we have two corners coming back from injury. No, three. We have three corners coming back from injury. Melifon will sustain an injury. He came back late in the season. Um, he wasn't really notable. Uh, we lost Jerry Jacobs late. Uh, Pittsburgh game or Cleveland game. And obviously Jeff Okuda missed the whole year. So I would love to get those guys in camp, see what they can do. And they're doing great. You know, I think they're doing great. I talked to Jerry Jacobs myself. He said he felt great. Um... You know, I just I would just take my time with the injuries as it is, and as it is, I would take I would take my time with the injuries. But Okuda, he's looking good. I'm rooting for him. I'm I'm hoping he's a hustler. I'm hoping he comes out get that bag. These corners are about to get that bag. Uh, Awarie, Okuda, if they come away with three or four pick seasons, it's about to be. Even matter of fact, if you come away with five picks, you are sure to make twenty million. You gonna make 20 mil. So I feel like, you know, just the money motivation. Obviously, Akuda has a lot to prove. I know he's he didn't, didn't choose to come here. He didn't he didn't ask to be drafted to the Detroit Lions. He didn't ask for that. That's a curse. Drafting at three and all that nonsense. I'm not going to judge him for that. I'm gonna give him enough time. You know, Darius Slay took three years, four years to really develop. And we've seen him that like fourth year, that third year, have seven interceptions and, and become an all pro caliber player. So I'm giving him as long as I'm giving him as much time as he needs with the injury. I'm giving him much time as he needs to learn a position at a pro level because these receivers is going crazy. A lot of stuff, a lot of moving parts are happening in the Detroit Lions secondary. New safeties, new this, new that, new looks. So, you know, I'm, I'm rooting for him. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Love y'all.